The last two champs of the Naperville Central been a tip-off tourney matchup in first day action, the Mustangs and the Red Hawks. It's the first game of the season for Central, but it's tough to tell on this play. Taylor Stemmark comes up with the steal and finds Sierra Stansel in transition. A bit later, Mattia continues to struggle holding on to the ball. Mia locks the gala with the open path to the hoop after the steal, 10-6 Hawks. Second quarter, the Mustangs start to dig in offensively. Cheyenne Krell is off on the shot, but DeSandra Parker cleans it up, 26-20 Central. Giveaway is a big problem for MV in the second quarter too. Stemmark able to turn a turnover into another turnover. The second one's good for the Red Hawks, 30 to 22. In the third quarter, Matia starts going inside and it pays off. Parker realizes no one's on her back and sails in. Mustangs only down four. Next possession, beautiful moves inside from Brianna Hall. The sophomore good for the lefty shot. Central only up 30 to 28. After a timeout, the Red Hawks turn up the heat again. They go to captain Emily Kraft, one of her three triples, 13 points in the night. Hawks up five. Later, Kraft starts the break with the steal, then Stansel does the rest and one, 39 to 30. Mattia taking the punches and sticking around. Hall again displays a nice post presence. All of her 10 points come in the second half. Central up 43 to 42. The Hawks find their own answer with Stansel driving and finishing with the left hand. Back and forth in the fourth, the Krell three ties the game at 46 with 90 seconds left. Less than a minute to play, Sydney Bobo hit with a questionable blocking foul. At least that's what head coach Cedric Williams might be thinking. Kraft hits both of her free throws in the one and one to give Central a two-point lead. Mattia needs a bucket to tie or take the lead, but Hall dribbles the ball out of play. Central runs out the clock, so to speak, and grabs a season opening win. Once we realized that we can play together and like we can play really well together, once things just started rolling, it was really hard to stop us. When, when juniors become seniors, something happens. You know, they, there's, a, there's a whole lot more invested. And, you know, we played seven players tonight, and six of them were seniors, and they played like seniors. We came out with a lot of effort, and even though we didn't come with the win, I felt like we gave what we had, and we left it all on the court. When you have 28 turnovers against a team like, like Neighborhood Central, it's going to hurt you in the long run. Uh, but the girls never quit, and that's, that's all we can ask for at the end of the day. 